hello viewers welcome to my channel this particular thing you see here is a poultry menu and here is uh, the poultry menu and here is poultry menu we heap it here because here is a uh, sloppy why we heap it when rain will come is from up here coming down it will push it down to this place go down then these yams we also take it we are going to add a through my new one by one on top of it and very soon let me say tomorrow we are going to top here top here top here and where we come when we push it down then it will soak inside the ground and the yarn we absorb it, the root let me show you uh, one of the let me show you yam root the way the yam normally have a root <laughs> let me go down here this is the root of the yam. Like this is the root of the yam. This root of the yam is from this one. You from here to this side. See it? It's coming out here. From here. Then all of them, some pass here. And when rain will come, it will slope down. And this pottery manuna is going to slope down and it's going to take it somewhere uh, under it. It's how we normally uh, do it to get a uh, a very big uh, size of yam. Then, when you add this fertilizer, you can add the poultry manure floor at the at the extreme, at the back here, as at the back here, at this back here, as we add it. Okay. Fine. Now you can see here now. We have already heaped now. This is one, each of the yam even have a poultry manure. See this one, we keep one here, keep one here. We use about cups or one full hand. Like this one, we put manure, we will put manure. We make it to be closer here. But if your manure, poultry manure is fresh, it will not come closer to the yam stem. See it here. Let me go down for you to see it more. You can see it here, down here. You can see it done, each of them. We heap it. Yeah. This is the yam. One yam here, one yam here, one yam, one yam here. All of them with my new. And when the rain will fall, all of them are going to sink when the rain will beat it. And there's one I heap at the extreme down here. The rain will push it down. And all of them will be taking it. You know, yam root normally cross everywhere. All of them will sink. The yam root will make sure we capture all the manure. That's why I heap it there. I'm telling the fact. This is the yam root here. Let me show you again. This is the yam, you, the yam you root. See how the yam root is. It comes out. This yam root is from this one. This particular one. You see how it comes out. To take, uh, looking for my new. And it will pass over here. That airstream, I'm going to heap uh, my new. The water will push it down. And this one will heap here. The water will push some of them down. And it will collect. The one here, it will sink yeah you see how it looks like even all of them are under this place the the root of it under see this one here what? coming out this one that i showed you all of them scattered uh, everywhere i'm telling the fact you can see how i just heap it this one is about to come out the yam here see this one is about to come out the yam and this one already come out see how i heap it here this one, let me say, a few days we are going to place some of the pottery manure on, on them. There's no pottery manure there. Let me show it to you. You see. Here, this is yam. There's no pottery manure here. This side, no pottery manure. I've already put pottery manure here. Eh? This, the techniques are normally used. You may even have your own techniques, but this one is the best to me because of the root of the yam. How the yam normally suck uh, 
I mean, absorb uh, nutrients from the soil. When I do it, I normally make a get a, a very big uh, yam from it. I'm telling the fact. If you can apply my own techniques, that's no problem. I hope you enjoyed this channel. Please uh, like uh, and uh, subscribe. Thank you.